The Animal Welfare League of Charlotte County is getting a major facelift with the help from the developer of Babcock Ranch. I'm Fox 4 Charlotte County Community Correspondent Alex Orenchuk. And shelter staff tell me this will help the animals in their care be a little more comfortable. From landscaping to cleaning kennels. Volunteers with Kitson and Partners, the developer of Babcock Ranch, came to lend a hand at the Animal Welfare League of Charlotte County. We have over a hundred volunteers here today working on every possible inch of our facility, cleaning it up, making it um, more enjoyable, not only for the folks to come and visit, but our, our guests, our pets, right. our dogs and cats. Charles Brown, executive director of the No Kill Shelter, told me about 400 animals are in the shelter's care which means things like tree trimming can fall to the bottom of the to-do list. We struggle sometimes just to get the basics done, uh, which leaves a lot like our play yards. They uh, you know, turn into disrepair pretty quick. So to have folks to be able to come out, get them back into shape, um, makes it that much more enjoyable for the dog to go out and the human to go out with them. <laughs> Sid Kitson, CEO, told me his company has volunteer days like this one quarterly, choosing AWL this quarter because of its mission. When you look at what this is about with the you know, Animal Welfare League and the great work that they do when you see these animals and the, just the incredible work that they do, we're just proud to be just a very small part of it. Brown told me while large volunteer events are appreciated, the shelter runs on people volunteering daily, encouraging anyone who loves animals to come help out. I mean, it certainly hurt, helps the organization, but ultimately it's about coming here and helping the, all the unwanted and neglected animals of our county. In Charlotte County, Alex Orenchuk, Fox 4.